Welcome back, boys. Your boy Goon Squad, baby. Um, so last episode, you already know we got the cub food. Um, which you know we nicknamed the Rhonda because they like giving me females. Every gift Pokemon I get is a female, but um, yeah. So we went to the locations. I figured that out. Now we gotta go see Mustard. So let's go see Mustard, bruh. And then we on. Holla at me, bruh. We good, bruh. Yeah. Good, good. You two are just the best of friends now, aren't you? Cup foods really become more confident. How wonderful. I dare say, I think you're both ready. Follow me, you two. I need to heal. See what he got for me and my dog, bro. I guess this is a good as a spot as any. Now then, Goon Squad and Cup Food. If you want to become stronger, there are special training grounds just for Cup Food. Prepare yourself for the Towers of Two Fist. The blue tower is the Tower of Waters. And the red tower is the Tower of Darkness. Choose wisely since you'll only be able to climb one of the two towers. Cup food's fighting style will change depending on the tower you choose and the types it gets will change as well. Think carefully. Each tower is five stories tall and each floor has a tough opponent waiting for you. Make sure you level up cup food properly before you try to climb up. You can reach both of the towers by heading through the forest to focus. You might even be able to find a shortcut if you can ride your bike across the river. I'm really looking forward to when you two make it to the top of one of those towers. It's gonna be exciting. Dang, bro, he ain't even tell me much. Well, good thing I gave him them candies, bro. So, first things first. You know I gotta have my dog ready. My dog drip. So, where them candies at? I give him, we'll just give him 15, okay? Yeah, that's about right. Shell smash, yes. We gotta have a team right. And y'all see I got Edward scissor hands. The homie know before he asked for he asked me to get the scyther, so I got the scyther, bro. It's only right. Only right. I don't need that. Yes, sir. Let me go ahead and change this. Yay! Make it a little larger. Okay. Oh, drip. I could use this. I get rid of the bite, bruh. Okay. Then. Oh yeah, Edward. We got the Edward, bruh. We'll get him six. Yeah, that should do it. 
All right, let's get it. I've been seeing everybody rolling around, bro. They got their bike clean. I gotta change mine up. We going, you know what? And this sucks because I got two water types already. So going to the Tower of Water, that, nah. I'm still going. I'm a water type trainer. Y'all know this. I like water types. God, I want that Volcarona so bad. But my team is made up. My team is made up. Yeah, the water spot. Hello, Goon Squad. Master has already sent word. This is the Tower of Water. It's a special training ground that only Cub Fu can use. If you want to climb the tower, please make sure that Cub Fu is the only Pokemon on your team. Oh, no. All right. Uh, okay. I have to deposit. Don't mind all this madness that I got here. Eyeball drip for no reason. All right. We got to put a new item on them. We're going to put the... Uh, No, I don't want to move anything. I need to give him something else. We're going to give him... Not the expert belt. We're going to give him the... Uh... Where is it? It's not the black belt. I don't even know what it is, guys. We might have to give them the lefties, bruh. Yeah, the black belt. That's it. And then... We're gonna hit him with this max potion. And then we're gonna hit him with this uh, elixir, bruh. Now let's go in there. Me and Rhonda. Let's go. Let's get in there. I'm sure. I'm sure. She about to hold this L. Rain falls to become a river and the river will eventually flow into the ocean. Such is the great cycle of water. It will swallow you whole. Hey. I'm a water type trainer, bruh. I'm a water type trainer, bruh. You know what that brick break? Yeah, yeah Rhonda. Yep, give me your money. All that. Homie with the dreads about to get clapped. In a round cup, water becomes round. A square teapot, it becomes square. Water is adaptable, changing from changing form to match the opponent. Prepare to drown it in its power. No, I live in this. I told these boys I'm a water type trainer, y'all. They don't hear me. Come on, Rhonda. Clap. Clap. Uh oh. It didn't clap. 
It didn't clap. Speed. Maybe I should have just head butted him. Yes, sir. Get him out of here. Yep. Give me your money. Y'all so generous with the coins, bruh. I appreciate that. Let's see. Raindrops may be small and weak on their own, but a torrent of rain can grind rocks to dust. Do you have the willpower to withstand the relentless torrent of my raindrops? She brought out the marrow, bro. What raindrops? Uh-oh. She had the aqua jet. Oh well. That headbutt was pointless. Yes, sir. That's what I'm talking about, Rhonda. I give you all the praise, Rhonda. Get old Meryl out of here. And give me your money. Yeah, 53 large. Hold that L. Hold that L. Water will freeze and harden when cold or evaporate and fly through the sky when hot. Water changes its form, even its name on a whim. Can you contain it? Yes, sir. Okay, okay, coming up a little bit. I wonder who's at the top. Uh, Brit break him. I should have had buddy. Hey, that's not good. Only delaying the inevitable. Delaying the inevitable. Hey. There you go. Yes, sir. Give me your money. Top. Let's go to the top. Bro, how must it get up here? And we seen him. I'm pretty sure I seen him go back to the dojo. Pretty sure. There you are. I figured you choose the Tower of Water, so I decided to wait for you here. Goon Squad, Cup Food, you've both done well to get this far. Your final opponent is little old me. It's been a while since the last time I battled like this, but I think you can handle it. A stream too clear is avoided by fish Pokemon. We all need some darkness in ourselves. Let me be the one to teach you the final lesson on the essence of water. Water. Oh, hold on, Mustard. Hold on, bruh. Hold on, Mustard. Wait a minute. He didn't transformed on this, bruh. Shit, how many cup foods he got, bro? I need to get serious if I'm to take you on. Hey, I ain't asking you to fight me now. Just let the Pokemon fight, okay? Hit him with that aerial lace, bruh. Yeah. Hey, wait. Oh, shit. 
look, so I wasn't healed, okay? I wasn't healed. I wasn't healed. Caught me on guard last time. So, that's all it was. I'm healed now. Now what's your excuse? Hope this area lays fair. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's hope this don't knock me out now. I don't know what, what the hell, what the hell kind of cup who he got. Yeah. How about that? Yeah. Lay down. Rhonda. Yes, sir. Don't laugh. You young folk grow so fast, it never ceased to amaze me. Give me your money too, Mr. Mustard. What a team. Impressive, most impressive. Yeah. Yeah, sir. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dog. Rhonda a problem, bro. You see Rhonda. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I knew you were worthy of my trust, Goon Squad. You have done well. Very well indeed. In raising Cub Fu to this level of strength. Leon was once my best student a long time ago. He too attempted this trial, but he never made it to either tower. He got lost along the way. Now... It's finally time for Cup Fu to evolve. Go and show Cup Fu the scroll of waters. Cup Fu is ready, ready. He is ready. Come over here by this scroll, my dog. Yes. Go ahead and look at that thing, bro. Go ahead and read it. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. Yay. Yay. There we go. Fighting water, bruh. What's the move he learned, bruh? Surging strikes. I think this is the one that I needed. Yeah. Three times in a row. Um, we gonna get rid of that, uh... That head butt. Behold, before you stands Urshifu, aka Rhonda. Rhonda, bruh. Sure to be unyielding armor that will shatter any blade turned against it. And it has mastered the style of water. Yes, sir. You've certainly grown, haven't you? And to think, not too long ago, you would have run and hid behind me the moment you got scared. Indeed, no matter how old I get, witnessing someone grow always brings joy to my heart. Goon Squad, Rhonda, thank you both from the bottom of my heart. Oh, I almost forgot. I give this to anyone who has faced me when I was taking the battle seriously. Not the lead card. Now then, let's head back to the dojo. Such talent and strength. Perhaps the time has come. Now I need to get my team back. Okay. Hey. 
Oh, you, you a little fast, my guy. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get back to the dojo, bruh. I know they ain't bring this lane back, bro. Oh, hey, welcome back, Goon Squad. Looks like you've been hard at work keeping up your training here at the dojo, eh? <sighs> Surprise, and nicely done, Goon Squad. That's just the reaction I was hoping for. I'm here on the Isle of Arm to research more about the Dynamax phenomenon. So, I hear that you two are friends. How delightful. Hoppykins here was just asking my permission to camp out on the Isle of Armor, but where's the fun in mucking about in the mud? I was telling him he should stay here at the dojo. I mean, it'd be loads easier than camping out for a long while, but wouldn't I be in the way? Everybody's welcome to wear out their welcome at the Master Dojo. Don't be shy, my boy. Besides, we're practically family already. You're the little brother of our Leon, after all. Yeah, it's true. Lee did train here when we were both kids. All right then, Master Mustard, you twisted my arm. I hope you don't forget it, because I'm staying. Woo! The more the merry. I'm pleased as punch in a gold-plated punch bowl. Which reminds me, Goon Squad, I've got something I've been meaning to tell you about cup food, or really, it's evolution, Urshifu, Rhonda. The truth is, the lovable rascal is capable of Gigantic Maxim too, but it's a bit tricky because it really can't stand the taste of Max Mushroom, so Max Soup is off the menu, unless you can make it more appealing to it. There's a certain something you can find here on the Isle of Armor though, that'll make even Urshifu gobble up a bowl of Max Soup. And that certain something is... It's actually... What is it? The suspense here is killing me. What is it, bruh? Actually, I've forgotten what it is. You're even more fun to tease than your brother ever was. The certain something I'm thinking of is sure to make Max Soup more palatable to Urshifu. And it has something to do with another Pokemon. Now I think I'll let the two of you figure out just what it is. Give it a good think together. You're on your own, kiddos. The world is your cloister, so get cracking. I've really got no rapid dash in this race, but even I'm pretty curious about that certain something. I think I read something about Urshifu in a book once too. It's the Wushu Pokemon, right? The book said it lives in the mountains in some far off region. You didn't know? Don't you have one? But yeah, I think I read that Ursh Urshifu was absolutely mad for some kind of sticky honey. Honey is made from the nectar of flowers and plants, right? So maybe we need nectar made by some Pokemon that looks like flowers and plants. And if we're looking for those, yes, Forest. All right, let's go to Forest, bro. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's go. Let's find the Forest. First, I need to get my team back, bro. I gotta get Delilah, Phoenix, Edward, Drip, and Drizzy. All right, let's go. Find this floor. What was that? Oh. Let's find this forest. That's not the way. Uh oh. Um. Here it is. Old Merrill's. Yeah, I know, bro. Can't stand hot, bro. He's so lame. Finally, Goon Squad, I've been waiting forever for you. I thought Glenwood Tangle was a real maze, but this place is on an entirely different level. And it's so hot and humid that I'm sweating the pond over here. You the G with the fur coat on, bruh. Sonya and I split up places to survey, and she opted for the cold and snow and all. Too bad we can't somehow divide this heat up between us, too. We both feel a bit... 
Anyway, I was checking out this Forest of Focus place while I was waiting for you to show up. And I saw signs of that Lilligent and Applin live here. Maybe we can gather a bit of sweet nectar that Urshifu should love from their flowers and fruit. Well, let's see. Let's see what I can find. What's that? I don't need that. What you got for me? Look, it's a Petalil. Petalil evolves in Lilligent, which is just the Pokemon we're looking for. Okay. Hey, doesn't that Petalil seem to be acting a bit strange? Looks lost. Yeah, now that you mention it, it's still pretty little. Maybe it got separated from its parents. Oh, who are you glomming on to, mate? You really must be lost if you think I'm your mom and now I'm stuck. Okay, gotta help us out here, Goon Squad. Go find this one of Pet Lil's parents or something, would you? Look for some worried looking Lilligen. I'll wait here with this little one. I'm afraid I'll step on it if I start walking around. That's why you just pick her up. That's it. Let's see. No. Get on a bike. See what I can find. Oh. Let's see what I can find. That's nice. A leaf stone. Use the bridge. Oh, look at that. We found something. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go back and take you to, hold on, I gotta find the right way back. Uh-oh. Old Benipede. Yay, we made it. Uh oh, I lost it. So I gotta walk back with it, bro. It's not nice. Bro, I don't even know which way I went. Where are you at? Don't tell me I left it all the way over here. Bro, I lost it. Oh, there she is. Come on, let's go. Okay, we can just walk then. Okay. Why would they do this to me? They know I'm trying to be Sonic. Gotta go fast. Sonic. Gotta go faster, 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 faster. Okay, you still behind me. We made it. No, I'm trying to talk to Lame Hop, bruh. Finally, Goon Squad, you found Lilligent. Or is it Lilligant? 
I think it's Lilligant, like elegant. That's how things make sense. What'd you think, Goon Squad? I say Lilligant is trying to thank you. Yeah, give me give me the uh the honey you guys speak of. Huh? Is this some of the nectar from your flower? Yay. Yay. That's what I'm talking about. Nice one. Now we got some of Lilligan's ne nectar. Hopefully this nectar is sweet and sticky just like Urshifu likes it. Hmm. I definitely wouldn't call it very sticky. It's pretty watery. I don't think this is what we need, mate. But at least... We did a good deed anyway. Come on. Let's give Apple's nectar and try next. Jeez. All this for a little G Max. I'm with it. I'm with it. No. Okay. Let's find where old Hop went. We'll go around. Ooh, Applin. I just seen it. There, it's an Applin. Bro, he be rolling up. Where have I been? I thought he hopped or something. This is rotten. I don't see the Applin anywhere. But I'm sure it went rolling off this way. We've got to find that apple. Yeah, we do. Is it in the tree? Yep. Huh? Something wrong with that berry tree? Hey, buddy. It ran off again. Goon Squad, is your head feeling a bit moist? That's got to be Apple's nectar on you. It must have given us the slip, but at least we still got what we came for. But Apple is sweet enough for Urshifu. food. Well, like they say, the proof is in the pudding or the Apple, so let's give it a try. You just ate some shit off my head, bro. Hmm, I don't think you describe it as sticky exactly. It's more like a juice or something. Lunja's nectar wasn't it. Apple's nectar wasn't it. They weren't really sticky enough to be the sticky honey that Urshifu loves. Come to think of it, they aren't really honey at all, are they? I was thinking nectar and honey were the same thing. So I was looking for plants and flowers, but was I barking up the wrong tree? Oh, a vinipede. I don't see one of those every day. It's cute though, right? But it can produce a really thick, gooey poison inside his body, making it pretty dangerous. Nah, that's it. I was stuck on Pokemon that produce nectar, but what we really need is a Pokemon that uses the sort of nectar to produce something else. Beehive. Yes, I have. It should, I think we should find some on the island shaped like a honeycomb next to the big blue tower. All right, let's go. No, don't get hurt by Rhonda, bro. Go ahead, Rhonda. No, don't do it, Rhonda. We're not gonna hurt anybody on purpose. Not today, at least. Let's get out of this cave. All right. Y'all leave me out of it. God, I'm so hyped to use a Spore Amoongus. Yay. Let's go. Licky licky. A bolster. Okay. I'm 
Okay, there's the water tower. Where's the honeycomb looking place? Let's see here. We'll start this way. Unless it's that one all the way down there. No. Honeycomb C. Honeycomb C. I'm telling you, it's probably over there. I hope not. Honeycomb Island. We just gotta see hop. As soon as we see, yep, there he goes. There you are, Goon Squad. Glad you could finally make it. I've seen loads of Cumbie around here, but no sign of Vesper Queen so far. But they're the ones that have the sticky honey. Huh? I borrowed a power spot detector from Sonya, but why is it going off now? reacting to this tree here something's got to be up going to I think we should check it out I mean we right next to the tree let's do it shake it it's a big tree to shake yeah uh oh oh that's crazy A beehive. Regular Dynamax for now, but soon, my boy. Soon, my boy. Raise that speed. Yeah. Raise that speed. Hey, that's not nice. Okay. Uh. Rhonda's about to go down. Okay, guys. Acrobatics. Sorry, Rhonda. Uh, yeah. Come on, Drizzy. I'm saving Drip. Hit him with that beam. Get on with that beam again, bro. Oh, yeah. The hacks. Froze him or her. All best queens are femmels. Hey, I got the max honey. Cool. 
That is some seriously sticky honey. I'm sure it's to certain something. And it seems like the honey was setting off my power spot detector too. The max mushrooms in this honey can. You can find it on the Isle of Armor. They both seem to have some kind of tie to Dynamaxin and Gigantamaxin. There's tons we don't know yet about it, so there's tons of research just waiting to be done. Come on. You got the thing you were looking for, so let's head back to the dojo. Alright, so we'll end it here. Um, and then the next episode we'll make the soup. We'll have a G Max Ronda, and then we'll be good. If you're not subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe. Hit that like for your boy. This your boy Goon Squad signing out.